Welcome back, everybody. We are back with Bob the Painter and his Stardew Valley adventure. Um, what were we doing? Oh, it's a new day. Let's open. All right. Letters. Oh, this is from the wizard. The chambers are west of the forest lake. The information concerning your rat problem. Dope, dude. All right, so let me... I have things to do first. Sorry. First, we are going to water all of our stuff. And we'll talk to Wizard Boy. Uh, I can't wait for these beans to actually just... I think those uh, parsnips at the bottom there, those should be done by the, tomorrow. <clears throat> yeah, those parsnips at the bottom should be done by tomorrow, and the ones in the middle should be done by the next day. And then these ones should be done by the day after that. So I have <clears throat> quite a lot of parsnips. Although I do have melons somewhere. I don't, I don't remember where my melons were. Actually, I think it's the top... Anything that I just said was completely incorrect. <laughs> Melons take forever. Forever. But, you know, that's okay. But I think after these parsnips are done, and I get the money from them, I think I'm actually just going to do... Potatoes, they sell for more, they take just as much time, and there's a chance for them to give you two instead of one. What is it, Sunday? Alright, come on, wizard. Oh, look, there she is. What's she got? I think she only shows up on Saturdays and Sundays. Wild horseradish. I can't believe you're selling wild horseradish for $600 when I could find them and sell them for $80. Look, a leak as well. Whatever. Alright. Let's go check out the wizard, dude. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> hey now, come on in. Look, I installed Borderlands 3. <laughs> I'm a Rem Rasmodius, seeker of the arcade truths. I'm not gonna do voices for everybody. I just like this wizard's voice. Like, <laughs> I like this wizard. Meteor between physical and Ethel, master of seven elements, keeper of the sacred ch. You get the point. And you, Bob, the one of those arrivals I've long foreseen. Sure, dude. Here, I'd like to show you something. Behold. Oh, it's a little green thing. You've seen one before, haven't you? Yeah, dude. Why don't you let them go? They call themselves Genimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. It's because you're a jerk and you capture them. I'm not sure why they move into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. Sure, dude. Huh, you found a golden scroll written in some unknown language? Most interesting. Stay here. I'm gonna go see for myself. I'll return shortly. Zoom! Huh? 
What? Why did he come through the front door? I found the note. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. Where are you now? We, the ne to Nemos, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for the gifts of the valley. If you're the one of the forest, uh, or if you're the one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of the scroll. Hmm. My lunch isn't ready yet. Hmm. One with the forest. What do they mean? Sniff, sniff. Yep, needs a little bit of salt. Aha! Come here. Try out my soup. A cauldron is bubbling with the ingredients for the forest. Baby fern, moss scrub, camel top, toadstool. Can you smell it? Yeah, yeah, dude. It smells disgusting. Here, drink up. Let's let the essence of the forest permeate your body. I don't, I don't really want to. I don't, I don't want to do it. Ugh. You. Oh, I'm about to throw up. I'm all green. I don't like this at all. This guy just killed me. Never trust a wizard, guys. Never trust a w what's going on. What is going on? Oh my god. It's the Twilight Zone. You have entered the Twilight Zone. You gained the power of the forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of Janemo's scroll. Awesome! Awesome! I could read what they said and it's 10.50 now. Damn, that took an hour. You gotta be kidding me. Oh well. Well, since I'm here, let's go see how my, uh... Aha! Horseradish. I'll keep you. Oh, but my energy went up. That's pretty cool. I didn't know that it happened. Actually, yeah, he's a pretty nice guy. Oh, more hush radish. I love that. Let's see here. Oh, daffodils. Or er, dandelions. Wild onions. Only two? Man, waste of my time. Well, maybe not a right waste. I got all these uh, horseradishes. Horseradish sell for good monies. Uh, I've already talked to you before. Ooh, worms. So these worms have a chance of dropping stuff for the museum they drop books you can get the clay from them stone um but also on the mountain i don't know if it's on the mountain or if it's in the dungeon you can get a dinosaur egg and the dinosaur egg it's it, it plays the same purpose as the chicken <coughs> to where uh, you know, you incubate it, you make the dinosaur, and then it'll uh, lay eggs, and you can sell the egg. And I have, I've played this game so many times, and I have never, <laughs> never found the dinosaur egg. Um, I'm just gonna sell all of this stuff. I don't really need my. Uh, there's not really much to replenish from an energy standpoint. I'm just gonna. Go around and search for things. Um, actually, I'm gonna go to the community center. I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, alarms! See, look, there's a book. So I'm gonna show you why I've been saving some things for this community center. All right, all right, all right, all right. And I think maybe later. We'll, uh, because I think, I think the next day, so tomorrow, I think, the, uh, the call, oh, it's done, oh, I can get this, okay, here we go, here we go, 
Yes! Just peering down into this old mine. It's been abandoned for decades. This guy really looks like Decker Kane. Still, there's some prop. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But it's a dark place, I'm undisturbed for so long. I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Here, take this. You might need it. Yeah, a broken, rusty sword. Thanks, dude. Name's Marlon, by the way. You may call me Deckard Kane. I run the Adventures Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye. Prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. Thanks, dude. Although, I don't really want to go down there today. I'll go down there tomorrow. I'm not prepared to do battle, but I will go down there and I will show you guys the glory of this game. This game is just so much... It just has the best of both worlds. You just... You farm... You make crops, and then you go down and you kill monsters. Find ores. It's great. It's a good time. So. Ooh, a daffodil. Another daffodil. Okay, so. We're back in here. Now we go down here. Oh, don't run away. Now. So these are the bundles. Basically what it is is you fill out these bundles. So it asks for daffodils, leeks. So I have... Oh, uh, I'm only missing one. So... And they don't have to be in order. I just kind of like putting them in order. And when you finish one, it gives you stuff. and opens up the next one. So I need to come back with the daffodils. Uh, winter, exotic, foraging. So those stuff, most of that stuff you can find in the... Dungeon, and then you have fall, winter, summer, spring, construction. So let me go over here. And then this one will open up. And that's the crop one. And that's So my first time playing this game, I didn't, I wasn't able to like, I had to wait till like year two in order to finish the community center because I had missed the fish. I had missed the... Um, the, the, the crops. And the crops are kind of a hard thing to... I'm going to go back and get rid of some of this stuff first. Um, the crops, once you go past the season, like spring and stuff, it's very few chances of you being able to get the crops you're looking for to finish that bundle. Um, the gypsy woman... Oh, look. That's all I needed. Shoot. Um, the gypsy woman, she... Um, sometimes you'll get lucky and she'll have something that you missed or, or stuff like that. Um, so there's always a way to get all that back. Oh, I didn't want the seeds. Shoot. Oh, copper ore? Um, no, not what I wanted to do. Alright. There we go. It's okay. I have the sword now, so I'm no longer afraid of bats. I'm gonna sell these, these. And these. But also... I want you, because I no longer need you. No longer need you, no longer need you. I don't. Alright. Let's sell these. And then we're going to go check out some shells. Did I really just sell the dandelions? Dang it. Didn't mean to sell the dandelions. <laughs> oh, I thought I had some in here. That's okay. It's not like I won't find dandelions anywhere. I mean, shoot, I could get lucky and find them in the town here. So normally with the dungeon, I don't really worry about the dungeon until it rains. Because once it rains, that cuts so, like so much time and I can definitely go do it without a problem. Have I talked to this guy? Who are you? No. 
talked to you before. I've talked to you too. Give me some dandelion. Give me some dandelions. Talked to you before, skateboarder dude. You know what? I just realized. I don't know how long I've been playing this so far. Well, there's a daffodil. I don't need you. Are you guys gonna have dandelions anywhere? No? There's a mushroom, can I get it? Nope, can't get the mushroom. <laughs> do, 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 do. We're running, we're running. We're searching, we're searching. Shells, yay! Oh, gold ore, really? <laughs> Thanks, dude. Let's see here. More shells. Alright, well, I guess I didn't find any daffodils. That kind of stinks. Er, dandelions. Man, I always call them the wrong thing. Son of a gun. Alright. Need to have my sword out and ready. I don't think they'll attack me here. I think they only attack me at my farm. But I'm ready. No bat's gonna hold me back. <gasps> Bunny rabbit, goodbye. Yeah. Alright. So I don't need... What don't I need? Let's see. First of all, I'll put you in there. So I need either of those shells. Alright. That's a lot of forging. Let's uh let's go to sleep and see how that's gonna So actually I'm gonna show you this. We're gonna watch TV weather report. Welcome to number one to the forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be clear and sunny all day. Oh shoot. Queen of Sauce. Greetings, this week's dish, stir-fry. Now I know how to make stir-fry. Can I make stir-fry? No, I don't have the kitchen. But, when I get the kitchen, I can make it. <coughs> oh. Look at that. <laughs> Just from all that horseradish. 780, making my way in the world. All right, so let's see what the weather report for tomorrow is. Welcome. Yeah, partial cloud, light breeze. Expect lots of pollen. Ah, uh, that's not what I wanted to read. Oh well. Look, parsnips done. Nope, didn't want to do that. All right, now parsnip. I think I need to keep the parsnip because it. I don't know, I just can't remember certain things, but I have to find dandelions first, or else I'm never going to do it again. So, parsnip. Oh, uh, you know what? I can start doing fertilizer, too. All those ones in the middle are going to be done. So I have a parsnip. I'm going to keep that parsnip. Because it's either one parsnip or it's five gold star parsnips. So, and of course, I don't have any gold star parsnips, so I'm not too worried about it. But I, I, I've had people say, like, oh, why don't you just do potatoes first? Blah, blah, blah. Well, because don't, you don't really need potatoes. Potatoes aren't a thing for the community center. Um, so I'd rather do as many parsnip as possible to try to get these five star, um, you know, whilst there's still spring left. <laughs> is it spring? Yeah, it's spring. Because summer's next, and then fall and winter. That's right. We're just gonna water all this. Maybe I'll go down to the dungeon, too. That all depends. The 
problem is, is that I have no energy stuff because I just sold my first one. Which I know my oldest brother's gonna be like, "Well, why'd you sell it?" Blah blah blah. <laughs> That's okay. I'm sure I'll fix his horseradish. Is a good one. So if I find some horseradish or leeks, I'll keep them so I can go down to the dungeon. Now all these parsnips in the middle are gonna be done tomorrow. They're ready for me to sell. All right, there we go. Now, one thing I do always do with the other dungeon is, with the dungeon, is I make another chest and I put it in there so I can store all, like, my sword and uh, bombs and, and health things that I need for it. Um, but since in this, with this map, this farm, uh, I have <laughs> enemies that appear at night, I don't think I'm going to put my weapon in there, or at least not the weapon I'm using. But we'll see. I need to find dandelions. Some spring some uh spring onions wouldn't be too bad either. Let's see. Look, like there's some spring onions. I think I'll just keep those. Man, I'm supposed to get a quest from Robin that says, hey, here's my, where's my axe, blah, 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 and she'll give me $500 for finding her axe. I don't know. IDK, peeps, IDK. What's this? That's not what I need. So another thing you can do is you can run around the town. Ah, that's what I needed right there. You can run around the town and you can give people gifts and uh, make friends with people, and they'll do they'll do a lot for you. Like they'll give you um, increased like energy, and they'll give you stuff, and you know it's it's a lot of fun. But I I don't uh, me personally I don't normally do that until year two, just because there's so much that I need to do to start this farm off to get this farm to where. You know, I have all the time in the world. Have I talked to you? Who are you? No. I'm not looking for your Aunt Marnie. She's... She never does anything. Um. Oh, have I talked to you? Yeah, I've talked to you. Haley, that's your name. Um. So I don't normally go around giving gifts. Um. Oh, let's see if I can do this. So you see this garbage can? Oh, I can't check the garbage can. Is it only at night? I think it's only at night. So at night you can check these garbage cans. Um, the problem is that if you if somebody catches you checking the garbage, then they'll yell at you and the friendship will go down. But I think you can only do it like in the early, early morning or late at night. So we'll give it a try. Well, there's... Oh, see, no shells. That's a letdown. Shells sell for a lot. Let's go... I'm going to slap the community center real quick. I'm going to drop off this uh, dandelion. And then we'll go down into the mine. Now, the only thing I have a problem with in the mine is that I'm, I don't have very much room. So I'm probably not going to be down there for very long. But I'll show you the trick to the mine in a second. So we'll put you right there. It's completed. And it's going to give me spring um, seeds, I think. Yeah, and... I'm not too thrilled with that because they, they don't really, they're, it's just a mix of seeds. So I can get flowers, I can get produce, but meh. So after you, so at first, after you finish things, look, he's carrying it. Go, boy, go! Go! Oh, sorry, dude, I'm in the way of progress. Go! So now, spring crops. So I need, I need one parsnip, one bean, one. Um, oh, I do need a potato. Oh well, one uh, cauliflower potato. That's cool. But this one, I do need five. Oh, five gold star parsnips. So I need to. 
really get on the ball here. Animal bundle, fall, cats, okay, whatever. Now, this one, this fish one I can't, I, I hate, I don't like fishing at all. It's so difficult. So, and they don't tell you what the fish are, so you really just gotta do, oh, wow, okay, so I have those three, I have those three uh, shells. I think I actually may have one fish, one or two fish from there. But anyways, let's go into this dungeon so that we're not wasting too much time. Because in this game, if you're out past, um, I think it's two o'clock? It's either 1 o'clock in the morning or 2 o'clock in the morning. Um, then you pass out. And you go to the hospital and they charge you money. So, you, you have to have some time management skills here. I think the only the only person that I'm going to try to become friends with is this guy here, Linus. Because if you, get, if you become friends with him, he gives you sashimi. And sashimi is everybody's favorite thing. And it gives a lot. So, here we go, guys. I didn't really want these spring seeds with me, but, you know, whatever. So, basically what you do is you just come down here and you're cutting down some rocks, blah, blah, blah. And eventually what you'll find, and hopefully I find it sooner than later, is a ladder to go down to the next level. Now, this dungeon is randomized, so it will reset. Every time you leave something new, it, 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 it changes. Now... You can't go back to a previous floor unless you... It's every five floors. So every five floors is like a save point. So it saves your progress down in the um, dungeon. See, look, there's that. But I'm not done with this level yet. But you see, my energy is going down hardcore. Um, time to get rid of something. Um, some people are going to hate me for it, but I'm getting rid of the spring. I'm never going to use it. And I want that geode. Geode. I'm also going to use this. And look at my energy go up by a tiny, tiny bit. <laughs> no, don't eat it. What? I... Oh, I have like three of them. Shoot. Okay, so it's 440. I need three more levels to I have three more levels to go down <coughs> oh eat and eat again might as well right more energy the better and I need this now this next level should have some enemies oh it's dark oh So, sometimes you can find torches on the ground. There we go. Copper. Oh no, another one. So, I really... So, there's a backpack in the shop for 2000 that I really need to get. Because that backpack pack will give me an extra row... So I'm able to come down here and actually not have to go back up anytime soon. So, also I wish I had my bomb. Because that bomb will take out all of these rocks. It makes it a lot easier on me. Eventually you can buy bombs. I, I've already gotten one of those. You decide now to tell me I found a geode? So the geodes, you can go to the blacksmith and he'll break them open and it'll give you uh, minerals. So, like, ores and things like that. Aha! There we go. Alright. Copper! I need so much copper. Hopefully there's no other enemies around. Oh! There he is! Yeah! 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 This guy gives me, um... He gives crabs and... I think he drops cherry bombs. Oh, he doesn't drop anything for me, though. Oh, that's not the pickaxe. All right. Oh, there's another one. 
Oh, my sword! Where's my sword? Get away from me! And, like, he, he turns into a rock, and then, like, if he's laying down, you can't... Oh, yeah, he dropped a, a ladder. I love it when enemies drop the ladders. Alright, so I need copper. Oh, look, another ladder. Yes, you can find multiple ladders. Well... Oh, there's nothing else in this level, so... And I could spend this entire time breaking all these rocks down, but all these rocks are going to give me is either geodes, stone, or coal. And honestly, it's not worth the energy. I would rather go to floor 5, where my progress is saved, so that I can always just come right back down. And start at floor 5, instead of having to go from floor 1. Because I think there's a hundred and... I think it's 140, 130 levels... So now I can use the elevator. See? Ding! Back up there. So now, we're gonna run back to my place. Hopefully not get into any battles on the way. Daisy, you didn't eat your... So I fed my dog at 9 o'clock. It is now like 10 o'clock, and she's still finishing up her food. This never happens. I don't know what she was distracted with. What was that in the corner? You guys see that? Whoop. There's something... Oh! Put him in a wall. Drop him in a wall, and you can just keep him. What do you got? Seeds? I don't care about seeds in that. That's fine. Now, let's go put our stuff away and go to sleep. We need to go here. So, I need one of you, one of you. I don't need you. You guys can go ahead. But, eventually I will have something that needs those. Oh, I took the lantern. Put the lantern back. It's a decorative lantern. Alright. Oh, did it say pollen? Is that what it... Yeah. It's gonna be pollen. Hold on. I have a quest. Reach level 40. Sure, dude. Let's go to sleep. Let's see how much money I made. I can't remember selling anything, so I don't know. Level 1 mining. I can make cherry bombs now, but it's not... I'm not in a place where I can get rid of the resources to make cherry bombs. $175. That is such a sad, sad day. Alright, so I have $1,000 now. I'm going to have to do some parsnips. I'm going to have to go buy some potatoes. It's Tuesday, so i got to get that done. Um, but yeah, guys, so we're going to end it here. We will pick this up. We'll pick, up, pick this back up later but for now for now we're just gonna end it here and um, yeah guys so hopefully I'll be able to do some more of the dungeon so you guys can see because the dungeons a real good place it makes this it kind of makes this game the dungeon the farming um, the interactions with the people I don't normally do a lot of the festivals because they just I feel like they waste time because they start at nine and then after the festivals are done you're it's 10 o'clock at night so you can't do anything that day but for, for your sake, I will do it, guys. I'll show you guys all the festivals and things. So, yeah, guys, until the uh, next episode...